So today I wanted to briefly discuss the Case Shuler Home Price Index. Now it is an index that seeks to keep track of home prices by looking at repeat home sales. There is not one index, there is a national index, but there's also an index that keeps track of the 10 largest uh, cities in the United States. There's one that keeps track of the 20 largest cities in the United States. And as you can see by the tickers here, there are individual indexes for each of these 20 uh, cities. Now, of course, the current price isn't as interesting as the trend. Here we can see that home prices have increased over time and we are currently at all time highs. You see the housing crisis bubble there in the middle. Now, a lot of this increase is due to inflation. So there are, are indexes that adjust for it. Here's one for urban areas. We can see that we're near all time highs. Here's one incorporating all, all locations. You can see we're not nearly as bad as we were during the financial crisis, but still very high when you adjust things for inflation. Uh, here are the different composites. We can see again, the solid lines where they're not inflation adjusted and the dotted lines where there is inflation adjusting. We can also look at all of these different, you know, 20 markets out there. Now I do wanna say that I do have some issues with the way we calculate inflation, I have some videos on that. You should check them out by following these links right here. It's interesting to go all the way back in time now, Case and Schiller went back all the way to 1890 and set home prices there. And this is really interesting to me. You can see basically from 1942, you know, the housing really went up and it's kind of stayed up there. We can see a couple of bubbles there, including obviously this housing bubble. This doesn't continue on as far as the other ones, but it's interesting to go back in time and look at this. It's also interesting to look at you know, various points in time. Here we see kind of the, the housing crisis bust, you know, the financial crisis bust that where housing really went down. So pretty interesting stuff there too. Uh, obviously housing is a very important component of every person's life out there. Hope you enjoyed that. Thank you so much. I'm Brian Kosloski.